it's October, so you're probably thinking about pumpkins or trick-or-treat candy. But did you know it's also National Pasta Month? So pick up a fork and celebrate like a real Italian. Here to tell us how it's done, E! News host and first-generation Italian-American, Juliana Rancic, and her pasta-eating partner and fabulous hubby, Bill yes. Rancic. <laughs> Good morning, guys. Mangia. Hi, good morning. good morning. Manja, manja, exactly. You got it down. Yeah, that's right. Eat, eat. Hey, a lot of people, Juliana, may not know that you're first generation Italian American. Tell us about your background. I am. I was actually born in Naples, Italy. Uh, I moved to this country when I was about seven years old. And the word manja is, has to be one of the first words I ever heard in my life. Uh, oh. My mom, I, I can hear her voice right now. In fact, I heard it last night. Last night, Bill and I came home. We're here in Chicago, and my parents are staying with us. And before we could even get through the door, my mom's like, come on, come on, mangiamo, mangiano, Giuliano, Bill, mangiamo. Like, you know, you got to mm. sit down. The, the food's getting cold. Uh, so, yeah, you know, it's... We, we, I grew up, and I tell my friends this, I've been telling people for years, we, we had pasta on our table every night of my life, like literally every night of my life. Oh, well, and I have something in common with you. I'm married to an Italian, so uh, I know mm -hmm. Manja very well. You do, yes. you do. Yes. <laughs> Bill, uh, what do you think some of the differences are between the way uh, Italians and Americans eat? Well, like you, I've become an Italian uh, via marriage, and we've been going to Italy for almost uh, the last 10, 11 years together. And boy, it is so different. Because in Italy, it's a real experience when you have dinner. And that's the manja, mm. manja way of life. And I read a great article the other day, and it said in Italy, 80% uh, of the Italians actually set the table every night before dinner versus here in America, it's like 10%. Mm. Oh. So in Italy, it's about spending time with the family. It's creating an experience. They light candles, they set the table. Uh, and they really let dinner be a time where they can reconnect at the end of the day. Uh, and that's something that we try to embrace, and, and it's really the, the manja way of life. Isn't it just a great daily ritual? It really brings a lot of oh, it's, it's It reminds me so much of when I was a kid, because I grew yes. up in a family where every night we sat down at the table, yeah. and we talked about our day, we heard stories that our parents were sharing with each other, yeah. uh, and we learned a lot at that dinner table. Yes, as did I. I. I think it's a really valuable experience. How are you two celebrating National Pasta Month together? Well, you know, we partnered with Bertoli recently, and they have taken all the guesswork mm -hmm. out of making mm -hmm. an amazing Italian meal and quite quickly, to be honest. So uh, these are awesome. You keep these in the freezer. You can get them at the grocery store. Mm. Keep them in the freezer. You literally just rip open yeah. the bag, pour all the ingredients in this bag into a skillet. You don't even have to boil water. Mm. 10 to 11 minutes, you have the most amazing pasta. So th what's beautiful about that is that gives us less time mm -hmm. uh, in the kitchen uh, at the stove and more time with our family. And so during those 10 or 11 minutes, I set the table quite like this, actually. Just these little details that really make it feel like an Italian table. A little fresh, you know, fresh Parmesan, mm. the little grater, um, put the bottle of olive oil on the table. Crushed red pepper. Crushed red pepper on there. I yeah. like to take a nice, you know, uh, ro bread roll, cut it up, and put it in a nice bread basket. A oh. couple glasses of wine, light a candle. These are just really simple ways while the pasta is cooking for 10 minutes, mm -hmm. so that when the family comes to the table, they feel like, wow, you know, we're having a real family style meal. Oh, you guys are making me hungry. It looks beautiful. It's yeah. like it's, it's, I wish you could smell it. Oh, <laughs> I'm smelling it it's through delicious. the screen. I tell you, Bill. Yeah. Uh, you know, fresh food, but less prep time. Right? Uh, exactly. Exactly. Yes. exactly. Guys, how can we learn more about some of these dishes that you've shown us here today? Well, there's a great website. It's BertoliManja.com. And for those of your viewers who don't speak Italian, Manja is spelled M-A-N-G-I-A. Manja. And uh, last Manja, manja. Andiamo <laughs> mangiare. How are the Italian <laughs> groceries in Chicago, guys? Oh my goodness, uh, incredible. We have a, a really big Italian community here. We have a, a little Italy uh, on, the, on the southwest side of Chicago. So, Got these uh, fresh tomatoes yeah. at the grocery it's, store here. Uh, Chicago is a, is a real Italian town. Oh, you guys, thank you so much. Well, uh, what's the matter for you? It's, you. Been a, it's been a great interview. Thank you so much. Celebrate National uh, Pasta Month. Post your pasta photo using hashtag Manja Moment. That's my hubby and I. For more information, visit the website right there on your screen. Sean, back over to you.